Yo, yo, what's going on, guys? It's your boy, Steady Club, aka King SK. And guys, right now, I'm over at the gym. I know a lot of you have been asking. Yo, SK, what are you doing in the gym? What's your routine? All this and that. Honestly, guys, I really just freeform. I have a good time at the gym. It's really a good release from my day. You know, get rid of stress. And, you know, just build all at the same time. So, as of right now, I got a 45 and a 10 on each side. Uh, I, I think that's... Uh, one forty-five, one fifty-five, one or the other. I can't really remember. So uh, this is what I'm gonna start with. I usually do uh, twelve, ten, eight, six. That's usually what I do for the bench, and then I usually move over to uh, incline if it's available. If not, um, I usually go over to the uh, curl bar and the straight bar, and that's where I have the most fun. So I'm going to let you guys see uh, me benching real quick. Alright guys, so I just did 12 reps on the bench. This is going to be a part of my first set. Now, right here, I have some 45 dumbbells. What I do is I combine those with my bench press. Uh, it's kind of basically what most people would call like a, a superset. It's like basically no resting in between. You know, to get that maximum intense pump and burn. So uh, that's pretty much what I'm gonna be doing here. And uh, I'll let you guys see that as well. Gonna be the same thing, 12, 10, eight, and six. All right. So, now that I'm basically done with my first uh, super set, I'm gonna drop down to 10. So I'm going to bench press the same weight 10 times and then do the hammer curls for 10 as well. So let's do it. crazy crazy weight one day me and everybody here watching will be on that same type of time man. i think the guy had at least three four plates up there is going absolutely crazy but right now we're going to do what we can which is this right here the reason i choose to do this weight on camera is because i'm already comfortable with this weight i'm not really trying to impress anybody i just want to motivate people to get in the gym do right by their bodies because it's easy for you to get distracted and be demotivated and not want to do anything. So the best way to do that is each one teach one. So I'm no gym specialist by any means. All I'm doing is recording my lifestyle because I have the freedom to do it. So let's get it. I'm gonna get dumbbells, hammer curl for eight. This next set right here, it's only gonna be six reps. All right, I'm gonna do six reps, same thing. Then, once I finalize those dumbbells, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take another two minute rest. Then after that, what I'm gonna do is, I'm going to take the 10s off each side and just go for 135 as many times as I can until failure. And then I'll be heading over to one of my favorite spots. Curl bar, straight bar, and we're going to have some dumbbells as well. But it'll be light and you'll see why. 
Let's get it. myself to the 10 to 15 range is when I'm going to start, you know, reaching that failure point to where I'm going to slow down and I have to really focus on my reps to make sure that I solidify them because if I don't, then I'm cheating my own games. So uh, that's definitely one thing I want to mention to you guys that you want to do full reps. You don't want to do so fast reps because you're only cheating yourself, man. And basically, all that's doing is you're just moving off momentum and not pure strength. You want to use that strength. Because when you're using that strength, that's gaining, gaining, gaining. Everybody naturally has momentum. You know what I'm saying? So don't use the momentum to drive you. Use your actual, actual gains to drive you. Because that's where you're going to see results. And I think I just talked to you for about two minutes. That was the plan. <laughs> so, what I'm getting ready to do now is I'm gonna take the tens off both sides, run and grab some water, and then I'm gonna go to a failure. So let's get to it. to a failure what I want you guys to do right now is comment down below how many times do you think I'll be able to hit 135 let me know yes now let's get it That's 13, you was right. I figured anywhere between the 10 to 15 range will be where my failure point was. Obviously, because I don't have a spotter, I'm not gonna actually go to a failure because I'll fail. And then, that'll be even worse. That'll be a whole different situation. But what I'm getting ready to do now is, I'm getting ready to go get the things I need to set you guys up for my next workout. And uh, this is really my favorite workout. That's what I love to do when I do come in here. And then when I'm with my brothers, we definitely uh, switch it up and intensify it. So whenever the next time I'm in here with my brothers, I'll let you guys see what we do because uh, it gets kind of crazy. It gets real wicked, all right? So I'll be right back with you guys. All right, now this is my favorite part of the workout. So, first things first, I'll take these 12 pound dumbbells and I raise them in front of me one arm at a time and then once I do a full set with the dumbbell, the curl bar, the straight bar, I come back to these dumbbells again and I put it out to the side one arm at a time as well and that's just one whole set that's one whole set so I only do two of these just because you can obviously see it's a lot, but uh, 
I'll just let you guys see what exactly I'm talking about. And uh, you guys can try this yourself. Make sure you use comfortable weight because this does get crazy. So I'm doing the same thing. I'm using weight that I'm comfortable with. Like I said, you don't gotta impress nobody. Just get your gains in. All right, let's go. Be taking me out of the gym. Not my two feet. And I love my two feet, so we can't do that. But yeah, I'm gonna finish up my next set, and then when you guys see me, I'll be picking up the camera at another station. Alright, guys? See you then.
Alright guys, so a little update on how I'm feeling right now. I feel absolutely amazing. I am freaking tired. We did have a long day today. We had a long day today. Well, the best part of the day is unwinding at the gym, letting all of the day's problems out. That is what the gym is for. That's what I use it for. And I encourage so many of you guys to do the same because it's, it won't be like it won't feel like a chore to you it won't feel like a burden to you it'll feel like it's something good missing from your daily life routine so that's why I say to do it that way okay so as of right now like muscles are super pumped I'll show you guys right here in the mirror definitely it's there see oh uh, And that's not flex or anything, that's just straight from the workout. So that's how I know I got a good pump, got a little bit of sweat going. So definitely we'll finish off the day with a nice hot shower. But uh, yeah, that was just a mini gym vlog for you guys. Um, I'm not even gonna lie, today I wasn't even going to come to the gym because I felt like I had such a productive day. But I was like, you guys have been asking for like a gym routine, gym video. So here it is. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Don't forget to drop a like, subscribe if you are brand new, turn on post notifications on. And guys, comment down below what your gym goals are for 2023. And it's me, boy, Steady Clubber, aka King SK. Signing out, guys. Peace. Better peace, peace.